This weekend, thousands of people will head to Washington Park for the African Festival of the Arts. It's known as one of the largest and longest running festivals in the Midwest focused on African art and culture. And joining us this morning is founder Patrick Woodtor. Good morning, Patrick. This is your 27th year, so tell us about the festival and how it got started. Good morning, good morning. Uh, Patrick Wooten is here early in the morning, kind of tired, but it's going to be a, a very exciting and important day. And uh, we are happy to be in Washington Park where we have Africans coming from all around the world to showcase the beauty and culture of African people. And today we have uh, food, we have drumming, we have a lot of entertainment. So if you are in Chicago, anywhere in the Midwest that you can get here, get here soon. Um, tell us, how did you start the festival? This is now the 27th year. So how did it get started and why did you start it? The festival started uh, in Hapakot, which is in Hyde Park, near Obama's home. That was 27 years ago. We had a, a store called Window to Africa and it started as a promotion. And it grew from that point just by the sheer interest of people in Chicago, cultural people who have supported this event over the years. And we are happy to have that support and invite everybody to come and share the culture of Africa this weekend. Well, Patrick, we thank you so much for joining us this morning and for starting this festival. We thank you, especially because we feel so lucky to have this festival here in Chicago. Patrick Woodtor, he is the founder of the festival. Thanks again for joining us. And this reminder, you can check out the African Festival of the Arts today and tomorrow in Washington Park. It begins at 10 a.m. and ends at 10 p.m. We're going to have a link to ticket information on our website, cbschicago.com.